Hello everyone, welcome to the Big Breaking. We have recently got an eighth continent. This continent is by the name of Zealandia. Zealandia is actually 94% under the sea. As you can see over here, it is under the sea. And the remaining 6% is with certain parts of New Zealand and other islands nearby. Only 6% that is there above it is with New, De New Zealand and other islands that are nearby. When volcanic forces separated, the supercontinent Gondwana, we got the continents that we currently see 83 million years ago that all happened. Zealandia is not nearly as well studied because it is under the water and that has resulted in inconsistencies in its presumed form and structure. Now, if we talk about the features of it, its features are almost the same as the other seven continents. Elevation is above surrounding ocean crust. There is diverse geology, crust is thicker than that which are found in the oceans. Area is greater than 1 million square kilometers and it has clearly defined limits. Now how the map was created because we have gotten a new map for it. The scientists studied the collection of rocks and sediment samples that were collected from the ocean floor and this ocean floor was done through drilling sites. There were various drilling sites to which we got this, the samples and others came from the shores of the islands in the area. Then the team investigated as a part of secondary study, which included analysis of seismic data in the region. What kind of seismicity is there? And the whole Zealandia continent comprising 5 million square kilometer was then mapped more in detail. The examination of samples have revealed that there are geological patterns in Western Antarctica. A subduction zone may exist near the Campbell Plateau where the denser crust or denser group of plates, they go beneath the lighter group of plates. That creates a subduction zone. And this subduction zone gives birth to volcanism, earthquake, tsunami, seismicity. All right. But scientists did not detect magnetic anomalies in this region that disproves the theories of strike slip along the Campbell Fault. Magnetic anomalies are the anomalies that is the difference in magnetism depending on the location because different continents are actually located differently and that creates a difference in magnetism. Every rock has different kind of magnetic field. Campbell magnetic anomaly system it resulted from the stretching of Gondwana as it was being torn apart. That stretching eventually led to a break which resulted in the creation of an ocean floor that makes up the lower part of the Zealandia continent.